You know, a lot of questions are asked here about one out of 20 times somebody calls me up and say they have Pakistander in one area of the property want to know how to move it to another area. So what I have here, in fact, I dug these plants up about a week ago and I dug them up in clumps. This is a clump right here. And you can see all the white runners or rhizomes on there. Those are new plants. Now the easiest way to put this in the ground is to dig a hole maybe about four to five inches deep Put this in the ground and just cover it with dirt. Done. Now, another thing you could do if you if you really uh, want to take them apart and plant them in rows with a with a mattock, um, basically that you can also do that too. This patch that's behind me was planted basically a week ago, the same day I dug these up, and there's like four or five patches. I stuck it in the ground, and I, I don't have to do anything besides weed it in about oh another month or so. So, once again, it's so easy to dig this stuff up. Don't worry about cutting the roots. Pachysander is a vine. The longer the vine, the faster it's gonna spread. Now, this guy right here, you can see, this is last year's growth, the year before. The, the year before that, because it was touching the ground, it lost its leaves, and now it's starting to spread. This is how they spread. This is probably about a five-year-old plant right here, because they're, uh, Pachysander, it doesn't look like it, but it's really a vine. And it's a nice plant to have because it doesn't really climb things like uh, other other plants do. It might, if it has a little help, might be able to climb up a fence or something, but it doesn't cling to the trees. So once again, dig a hole, put it in, throw the dirt on it, done.